great place well, a couple of decades ago, suddenly appeared in the landscape of the country. Literally millions of tires and stones and hills and valleys across the country of country side. It's been accumulating over time. It's not just uh, a lot of landscape, it actually poses some serious problems. It's got the water, the rain, the rain, the potatoes that have no water. Well, all these, uh, you know, you have massive amounts of tires and uh, lightning strikes, and there you have it. You've got, you've got, uh, you've got a, a huge, uh, difficult to control fire. You're creating toxic smoke, you're creating toxic runoff with the tide of mouth, and a very, very hot, uh, difficult to control fire. Um, when, we, when we first started managing these uh, tire fires, one of the first things we did is start some fire lanes, lanes, basically, create lanes between tire fires. People who were in the industry, the tire industry, people in the state, the other managers, put together a task force to come up with ideas of how to deal with tires. And that resulted in the tire, uh, the tire management act. And so since then, so we've been five years, we have put out most of our tires. So since we did that with Pat, we have reduced that number of stockpiled tires by about 75%, and we expect to have them all cleared by the end of 2010. The clean tires, the clean tires that are, are being generated, the tires that are being generated today, a lot of them will be going into Columbia. That's a, that's a, we would consider a higher end use. Where the tires are actually put in a, a crumb like material, the ground up. And it's a very fine, very soft crumb like material that can be used in the as you said. It can be used as part of uh, what's, what's called the Arctic Research. It's a big part of the Arctic Research. It's exactly this crumb like material. It's also used in um, uh, running tracks. A lot of things can be made from crumb like it can be used in, um, it can be actually molded to make uh, a whole number of, uh, of products that say uh, mats uh, for gymnasium. Uh, I've heard that they're very popular with dairy farmers to ease the burden on very heavy milk cows standing on the mat for having a lot easier than the cows. But then, uh, again, a lot of products, a lot of tubing, um, a lot of manufacturing applications. The important lesson is uh, we can recycle uh, tires, I would say, the example here, but it applies to a lot of materials. We can throw an awful lot of stuff out in our, in our society. And if you think about it, if you, if you go into problem solving mode, as we had to do in the, in the tires, uh, You'll find that there are many, many opportunities for reuse and recycling for, for tires. And tires offers a, a spectacular benefit. 